Hey guys, it's Speedy Fitz here bringing you another Pokemon Go video. And in this one, we have eight two kilometer eggs. Uh, we dropped a lucky egg a few minutes ago, so we'll be getting 6,400 XP, which will put us over 40% of the way done with level 31. And we still have two big evolution sprees to go. And we're going to do those before the event's over. But, um, so yeah, we have eight two kilometer eggs. I'm hoping for new Pokemon, Lapras, Snorlax, or Grimer, I guess. Yeah, so, you'll, uh, my reaction will be, uh, good enough to tell you whether I wanted it or not. And I'll then I'll rate it on a scale of one to five. But, um, I'm not sure if you can still hatch bad Pokemon. Like, I know Geodude's not bad because Gollum's pretty decent. But I'm wondering if you can still hatch those. I'm not sure. Hopefully we don't find out. Because we won't hatch them. Like if we if if we find out, it means that we would have hatched one. So we don't want that. We don't want to find out. But um So here we go. We have eight two kilometer eggs. Um I was out for most of the afternoon so far, just hatching these. Pretty casual. I figured out like the average percent of getting a Pokeball from a Pokestop. And for me, it's around 67%. So for every three Pokestops I go to, I'll get two Pokeballs. So that actually helps me if, like, I want to get 100 Pokeballs. I'll know now how many Pokestops I have to go to. But, okay, let's get on to the eggs. <clears throat> we also have a 5k incubating, but it's it's only at 2 kilometers. Okay, Machop, you know I'll take that, especially if this guy has really good IVs. We'll definitely take the double candies. Yikes. Only seven? Okay, so, I uh, give it a two. I'll give it a two. Solid two. Was there something rare on my nearby on the far right? I couldn't really tell. Okay, you know what? We got doing a Charizard in a future, in a very near evolution spree. So that's good. Does it mean double candies or more candies? Because I can't imagine getting only three candies for a Charmander. Um, oh, it's just a shelter. The outline kind of looked like something weird. So this is egg number three. Let's freaking go, boys! This is a five. We now have enough candies for our Dawn fan. Um, that was definitely double candies. Wonderful. That is savage. Okay, thank you. That That's great. Okay, I'm fine with it. If I don't get anything else good, that's okay. So this is egg number four. Ugh. Not another growler. I had two in a yesterday's video. Okay, now we're on to egg number five. So we only have three more after this. But it's still three more, so you know I'm not I'm not that angry. Ellie kid? <sighs> not that good. I'll, um I'll go back through at the end and rate them. That's I'm not gonna do them right now. We all we want is like a grimer and like a milk tank or a lapras or something. Okay, so yeah, I'm not very pleased right now with what I'm getting. We have this. We have two more, including this. So, oh. <laughs> we already got our wheezing. Okay, last one, Grimer. Please, Grimer or Mill Tanker or something good. Dang it. Okay, that was the last one. Not great IVs. And there's the 6,400 XP. Um, did this gym get taken? No, it's still there. So now we're over 200,000 XP. Uh, okay, now I'll go through and rate them. I'll change their names and then we'll find out how good was it. Okay. Boop, that's a five. This is a two. And then we'll just like figure out the average and that will be that. Charmander, I'll give it a three. You know, we had enough candies, but we got some more to power up a Charizard. Um, two. You know, not really that great. One, I don't care about Electabuzz or Ellie Kid. Hooper, one, terrible, don't care for it. 
coughing, you know, if this had happened before I got my wheezing, I would have been super happy, but it didn't, so I'm only going to give it, like, a two. Oh, and we also would like to Porygon, and then one. And then we'll check the IVs and see if we have to change anything. But I don't think any of them had perfect IVs, so no. Well, look at this HP stat, 127? That's pretty crazy. Okay. Perfect attack. HP is decent. Oh! We got a perfect IV Ellie kid! What? Okay, you know what? You know what? You know what? We're gonna evolve this guy. Not right now, but... Holy crap, that's pretty lit. Uh, 100 IV Ellie kid. Okay, that's why you check the IVs. I was just gonna transfer it out. But, um, you know, that's, that's good. I'm happy with that. Now we have two more, right? With the Charmander here. I think the Charmander is the only one that has certainly caught the attention. Okay. Now, we're going to sum these up just so that you guys can understand how good or bad it was. We have one plus two plus one. Plus five. Plus five plus. Oopsies. One plus five plus two. Plus five plus three. Plus two. Plus two. Divided by eight. I didn't do this right, guys. Okay, I could do this 10 times faster on paper. Okay, guys, ready? Watch how fast I'm gonna do this on paper. Ready? Start the timers and begin. Okay, we got one plus two plus one plus five plus two plus five plus three plus two. Okay. Wait, I got the same answer. Huh? Maybe maybe I did it right. Okay. Wow. That really sucks. <sighs> Sorry if that was disgusting. Okay, we got two fives. Okay, I'll just sum it. One plus two is three. Three plus one is four. Four plus five is nine. Nine plus two is eleven. Eleven plus five is is 16, 16 plus 3 is 19, 19 plus 2 is 21, and then 21 divided by 8, that's going to be a little tricky, I'll use a calculator, yeah, it's 2.6, and then something's buzzed in here, it's a Venonat, okay, so, mm, that was awkward, so, all things considered, that was a pretty good uh, hatching spree right there, I might go back up and get some more eggs, they'll probably eat lunch first, it's like 140, um, I got a Togepi earlier. I got a, I hatched a Togepi and an Onyx earlier while I was collecting Pokeballs and more eggs. Um, I'll show you some screenshots. And I also caught a, a kind of a rare Pokemon. You can call it rare. And this Venonat just doesn't want to be caught. I don't know why. It just aired out. But um, we took this gym. Oh, my God. Pokemon Go hates me. Okay. Anyway. I'll just show you the screenshots of what happened. Okay, this is kind of cool. I did this by complete accident, but it's like a circle all around the 5Ks. There was the Togepi we hatched. We hatched the Onyx. Um, now, we, we also, I had found an Ursa Ring on, on the tracker, and then I went up to where it was. It's near a bunch of Pokestops, but it didn't show up, so that either means uh, one of two things, or both, but um, that it wasn't in range of a Pokestop, or that it had despawned from the nearby and was, like, about to go away, but um, I took a screenshot. Oh, yeah, it's not even close to any of the Pokestops. Okay, that solves that question, and then this was the Kadabra I ran into yesterday at the Pokestop, um, and then there's, like, a bay leaf. I don't know why I took a screenshot of that. Okay, okay, now I'm just, like, going back and forth. I don't know what I'm doing, guys. I'm losing my mind. Guys, as I was saying, 
if you want the uh, shout out when you subscribe to the channel which i hope you do um it will ask you about keeping your subscription public or private and i can't see your channel name unless you make your subscription public or you can make your subscription private and then comment me your channel name and i can still give it a shout out but um you can't keep it private and then not tell me what your channel is and still expect me to give you a shout out because i have no idea what your channel is um so yeah i hope this video was awesome um exciting speedy fits out